Hi everybody, welcome back to my YouTube channel, Makeup Fun with Olivia. Today we're gonna try something a little bit different. It's the end of the day, I've washed my face, no makeup, my hair is a total mess. I clipped it up in preparation for what we're about to try together. It's a product that I bought from The Ordinary that I was very scared to use. I think I bought it like two months ago and I've had it there and I've had it there. And you know what? I'm gonna make it fun and just share the experience with you. What am I talking about? I'm talking about the Ordinary AHA 30% BHA 2% Peeling Solution. This is an exfoliating solution by The Ordinary. It runs for about $7.20. I believe um, I bought it on the Sephora website for an ounce. This is what it looks like. Have you guys seen these videos? I want to try it out. Oh, and it dripped a little bit because I did open it a little bit earlier just to see it. But this is what it looks like. It looks kind of like blood. <laughs> I am a vampire lover, so <laughs> I'm not mad at this. But um, yeah, so this is supposed to help with texture, with fine lines and wrinkles. It's supposed to help um, with um, blemishes. What else? What else? dullness, uneven skin tone. So I decided let's try it. If it is important to you, it is free of sulfates, SLS and SLES, parabens, formaldehydes, mineral oil, vegan. It's cruelty free and gluten free. So, and a lot of other stuff that you can look up on the Sephora website, but I just wanted to mention those for you. Um, so let's jump in. It's a mask. You're not supposed to leave it more than 10 minutes. You are supposed to test a zone like on your arm or something, and I never did that. So so let's see how this goes. I'm gonna put a little bit on my hands <laughs> and jump in. We're doing this, you guys. We're doing this, and we're doing it together. Now I probably won't leave the camera on for those 10 minutes. I did put on some of my very thick lip balm to ensure that it wouldn't go into my lips, um, only because I've heard people say, you know, it shouldn't go into your eyes, it shouldn't, you know, go into like really sensitive areas. Okay, I don't have sensitive skin, you guys, and you are supposed to be very careful if you have sensitive skin. I'm already feeling the tingling. Okay. And I'm just going to put it in my face like this. I think that's enough. I don't think you you have to put a whole lot from what I've read. Um, this should be enough. A very thin layer, especially because it's my first time using it. So, so this is what it looks like. Um, it feels tacky for sure. I'm definitely starting to feel the tingle, but it's not painful. Let me give you a close-up. So I do use, let me show you what I normally use, is my Paula's Choice Skin Perfecting 2% BHA. I love this stuff. I use it about once a week. Um, if I remember, I'll use it twice a week, but realistically, it's, it's once a week. <laughs> anyway, so by the power of magic, we're gonna come back after 10 minutes. Ooh. Okay, I came back and added a little bit more because I felt like I didn't have enough. It's definitely tingling. I don't want to get it too close to my eyes. Okay, we're good. Okay, I'll be back. Just a quick check in, you guys. We're about five minutes in and I definitely still feel the tingling. Um, it's not painful. It just feels like a lot of little needle prickles. And it's, oh, sorry. I'm hold, holding the camera with one hand now. Um, and it's like one here, one there. It's not like all over. It's just, so. I feel like I was really scared for nothing, but we'll see. We'll see what the next five minutes bring. Bye. Make sure I take it all off. <laughs> Okay, it looks like I survived this. 
Um, I was scared for no reason. <laughs> I'm not saying you shouldn't be scared. Everybody's skin is different. And I already know that my skin is not very sensitive normally. So, but I was still a little bit worried because I had a little bit of sensitivity in weeks past, which I never really have. And I thought, what if my, my skin is getting sensitive now? Anyway, um, you know, it feels good. It feels good. I feel like I still feel a little bit of the tingling like underneath my skin. Um, and I made sure to wash really well because I was scared that some would still be on there. Um, I was very careful not to get it into my eyes because they say, you know, don't get it into your eyes. Um, you know, I don't know that you can tell a difference right away, but um, I will keep you posted in the weeks to come. I'm going to keep on using this once a week, exactly the way it says, instead of my usual BHA um, and see how that goes. Yeah. Have you guys tried this? Let me know. Do you love it? Do you hate it? Are you scared to try it like I was? <laughs> I survived it. I feel like it's a little bit, I don't want to say sensitive. It just, I feel a little bit of the tingling. And I mean, I always have pinkness here, so it's not due to this. It's just, you know, but, um, I'm going to keep on using it and see if it makes a difference. I feel like it's something that's not going to make a difference, but you know, we'll see. I will let you know. Let me know if you've tried it and what your results have been down in the comments below. Thank you for joining me today. Bye.